God almost certainly does not exist. If God is all-powerful, it should be able to do and create anything. It should be able to mold existence into whatever shape that it wants. If you say that God is incapable of creating a universe where free will exists, but there's no evil, then you are admitting that your God is weak. Amen! Dude, this guy is on a roll right now. Alright, so for those of you that don't know, this is an atheist, but he's describing God a lot better than most Christians do today. He's using the wrong pronoun, but whatever. I am going to read one Bible verse that gets me a a whole lot of hate comments every time I read it. Genesis chapter 50 verse 20. As for you, you meant evil against me, but God meant it for good in order to do what has happened on the stage to keep many people alive. So when Joseph's brothers sold him into slavery, yes, that was evil. Those sinful human beings meant evil against Joseph, but God meant that evil for good. Yes, God intended for evil for good reasons, of course. I also found it fascinating how he was basically quoting Romans chapter 9, where it says that God is the potter and he has authority over the clay to make from the same lump one vessel for honorable use and another for honorable use. God has the authority to create humans for destruction and humans for glory. Also, one of the dumbest arguments I've ever heard is that God can't create a universe where everything's perfect and have free will because free will means that people are going to sin. That's completely false. Uh, Revelation 21 says that God is creating a new heavens and the new earth earth and uh, everything's going to be perfect in the future.